Tigers dodged one there. Russell makes the call. Graves peels out. Russell threw the hit on the... The efficiency obviously continues to be a yeah. little bit of a... Off the step-up screen by Aldama, got the floater with Reeves and Schroeder. Cross-court, Hashimura drives the closeout. Good jump stop and a little short. Los Angeles with the Lakers post-trade. I chronicled his work. Make use of your opportunity. I remember when he came into the league, much harder to do. They ran the same set again there, Doris. AD with a good handle, missed the jump hook. And slips and falls at the other end. Memphis with a five on four. Big body Roddy with a to go in the third. Hashimura calls for it. Entry pass to AD facing up against Jaron Jackson. Nice little dream shake and a soft touch. The result of the huge margin goes underneath the screen. Here's Payne off the Xavier Tillman screen. Finds Tillman underneath for the reverse. Good offense that time by the Grizzlies who were shooting a paltry flip action to Davis. Bruder off the screen. The mini is pure. Yeah, and Bain with a quick counter. The Davis has had a huge period with 13 for the Lakers. Fakes the handoff. Tough mid-range. Got him. AD again. Okay. Lace is another one. This for D'Angelo and for AD tonight. Made them really notes, though. Well, didn't ad lib it. Uh, Malika told us that Tillman confirmed it. He was the best speaker of the three. <laughs> that's, Malika, that's that's correct. We got that right, right? We got that straight? That is correct. The best speaker of the five, and don't worry. Lead is 19. James, catch and shoot three. That's, that's, that's been a scuffle for LeBron all year. All his jump shooting is efficient as he is percentage. Bruder keeps it. Six on the shot clock. It's LeBron one-on-one -on -one against Bain. Kicks it out. Schroeder for three. Nothing but net. Behind the screen by Jackson. Out to Russell. 340 to go. LeBron walks it into the front court, makes the call. Crowd on its feet. Paul Kennard into the action. Tillman switches back. LeBron splits the double. Got it blocked by Tillman. And Jaw on the fly. Literally on the fly. And one. Morant raising up. And one. Jaw. Because your son is playing. Yeah. Davis slips out. Feels like stretches of less urgency at times for the Lakers. James with a show and go. Sprays it back out to a wide open Davis. Rims out to Reeves. Look what I found. Four to Reeves. Picture perfect offense. Timeout, Taylor Jenkins and the Grizzlies as the Lakers keeping them at arm's length. And he, he's got a knack for some timely buckets, boy. The offensive rebound put back, and the three. Little room to breathe. Madison Square Garden. Jock elevates and lays it in. Off game. AD going to dial up another three. Over and the left-handed finish. Again, it may not matter here. But you know where that matters? In route to a championship. Quarter. With that three-pointer, he's got the last 16 in a row for the Grizzlies. James turns the corner and lays it in over John. 3.08 to go. Reeves took a shot in the mouth. Russell lost the handle, and he turns it over. Lead at 14. Still time. Morant. Got it. Right? Right. You would think. Yeah. So some of that uncertainty gets removed from the entire equation for both sides. He's got to have built confidence in his ability to be successful, that's for sure. Yeah, that fall was gruesome. The way was... Jaw against LeBron. Here. 
Payne off the exit screen, knocks down the three, and it's back to a 10-point game. Lakers have gone deep into the shot clock on the last three or four possessions in a row. Russell hits the mid-range. That might do it. Well, John made a very impressive comeback to the court tonight, 45 points. But not enough because that guy, LeBron James, set the tone and tenor of this game early. Eight good points on his way to 25, nine rebounds, and five days.